you didn't count me out I'm counting my bullets, I'm loading my clips I'm writing down names, I'm making a list I'm checking it twice and I'm getting them hit The real ones and down Alright guys, starting to vlog off Right now, I guess <laughs> um, I just got off work um, As you guys know, I work so as you guys know, I work from Monday to Thursday with my regular 9 to 5 job. So right now, what I'm going to do, I'm going to head down to Starbucks. I'm going to meet up with um, one of my old clients, actually. Uh, one of the very first clients I had um, when I first started coaching. We're going to sit down. We're going to talk about some things specifically for video work because... I want to, you know, step up my game. I want to be more consistent with the YouTube. And having someone behind the camera is a huge help. I've seen, you know, Pat and I've seen Jeff, you know, really grow a lot on social media because they had that help. And, um, you know, they even said, oh, I waited too long to get someone behind the camera. So I want to just, like, get right in there because I know it's worth it at the end of the day. Um, what I've learned from my full-time friends that are into social media is that you need to reinvest into your business and now is the perfect time because I'm I'm back at home. I'm live with my parents. They're they're not charging me rent, um, but I'm going to utilize that money to um, you know prioritize this and to reinvest into what I really want to do um, for myself. So I feel like that's the the, the way I want to do things. Um, hopefully it all works out. You never know. Nothing's guaranteed, but right now I have to follow my heart, follow my passion, and. Uh, just do what makes me happy. So for today's video, we're gonna to go to Safeway because I forgot my wallet. I have to use my phone, I have to use Tap Pay. Safeway is probably one of the other grocery stores that uses Tap Pay. Walmart, I know they don't for a fact, so I'm gonna to have to pay the price and go to Safeway. So we'll see you guys there. I'm just gonna grab a few things just because I'm not gonna be in town. I'm gonna grab a few items. I don't want to go to waste. So I'm gonna grab what's important to me right now. You know. So I'm just looking for the cheapest Greek yogurt because, yeah, I'm kind of on a budget, you know. Might as well just get this, just whatever. Alright. No strawberry. Oh, you great. So one thing is key, is I put this in my Greek yogurt, and just literally tastes like a dessert. Um, if you want to put blueberries or strawberries or anything like that, good to go. I don't know, it's something simple, it's nothing really too crazy, but it definitely, one way to get your protein in, if you're sick of protein shakes all the time. Safeway is so expensive for meats, but they are better than Walmart, I'll give them that. Um, so. Like I said, I'm leaving for the weekend. I'm gonna keep it light. I'm just gonna grab just two chicken breasts for me. As you guys know, you've seen this on my channel lots of times. I call them simply shredders just because of the macros. You got five fat, nine carbs, twenty protein, and this whole meal. Now people say you should cook. I hate cooking, I'm a lazy guy, um, it is what it is. Yeah, I honestly don't even know what I'm going to get, like, and everyone's been hassling on social media, like, bro, you're spending so much money eating out, I'm like, yeah, I get it, I understand. Uh, I don't know, I like rice cakes, so let's go find them. Pizza, tomato, all-time favorites. Um, I actually have a bag of that at Pat's place. I'll grab one. And I'll grab these ones too. Good. <laughs> um, I eat really bad, man. Like, this is like exposing myself. Like, people are expecting all these veggies and all these stuff, but like, I hate vegetables and stuff. It's really bad. Uncle Ben, so literally just put this in the micro for two minutes and you have rice to go. <laughs> oh no, I'm so bad. But um, I grabbed the smoky flavored bean one just because it has the most protein out of all of them. Um, and I'm also 
so Spanish, so beans and rice is the thing. No. I'm gonna grab a pan of tuna. Just one. Sometimes I like mix it in with the rice, just put it all together. And if you have that bolt house salsa ranch, it, it smells disgusting, but it's really good. Four. Zero. What's the difference? I think the zero is like supposed to taste like real Pepsi, but all right, we'll try this it's, out. Then. Yeah, we'll try the zero. I think that's about it. Like I said, I'm, not, I'm going away for the weekend. I don't want to buy too much food, so and I'm also at Safeway. I don't want to get wrecked. But I know this is gonna cost like sixty bucks, so <laughs> we'll see what the total is. On. Oh, debit. Debit? You don't know a number or anything? Like phone number? No. Oh, no, absolutely not. There's okay. No Go ahead. Okay. Not right. <laughs> that chicken breast is pretty pricey. Yo, man. <laughs> what is that? Is that good protein? Three full breasts? It's two, I think. Only two? No, man, it's not two. <laughs> um, obviously, I'm not at my place, this is Pat's place. He's currently in Halifax, so I've been doing a little bit of house sitting um, and enjoying his beautiful condo. Is this a condo, right? I think so. Yeah. Yeah, I think it's considered a condo. Anyways, I'm gonna show you guys how wrecked I got, or I'll show you guys what I got for 50 bucks. So, like you saw, we got two Simply Shredders, got some Diet Pepsi. Got some Greek yogurt. No. No, it's just plain. Yeah. Greek yogurt tastes like sour cream. So sometimes what I do is I, I usually use Greek yogurt as my sour cream replacement because I'm getting that protein in. And a lot of people, when you're eating those kind of snacks, there's like no nutritional value in it. So at least you're getting some value in when you're using Greek yogurt as sour cream. I got Uncle Ben's Easy Rice, you pop this in the microwave for two minutes, like I said. Um, I usually demolish, like, I demolish this whole thing before a workout, um, usually an hour before. If I do it like 20 minutes before, then I'm gonna blow this out. So don't do that. Crispy minis, another thing of rice, and the Kool-Aid Mio, which I add to the Greek yogurt, literally tastes so good. Um, I don't know how to describe it. It's just like a little dessert. You have to you have to try it to really know what I'm talking about. Um, bananas, unlike the rice, if you're having a pre-workout meal, this is good for one hour to one hour and a half. For bananas, if you're like really rushed right right away to go work out, I have a banana. You normally before I work out, but that's probably going to change because I am slowly, you know, putting down my calories. And you know, something like this, you're looking at like 30 carbs or something. So I'd prefer to eat that somewhere else down the road. Um, another thing with protein, tuna. Um, some people hate it, I obviously like tuna. I can put that with the rice. You know, you microwave this, open this can, you get to go, you have a meal. Really simple. And the overpriced chicken breast that I bought. There's only two there and it was uh, $13.79. Normally how I cook my chicken is I usually use Pam, is that Pan or Pam? Pam spray. Pam yeah. spray, yeah. I use Pam spray um, and I use Dash for, dre uh, for dressing, for uh, seasoning. That's pretty much it for the grocery haul. I was expecting more, but I did forget my wallet. Um, you know, shit happens. <laughs> um, not everything goes to plan, clearly. You know, you know me and Pat, so. That's pretty much what I want to show you guys. Um, it's probably not what you're expecting. You guys are ex probably expecting more veggies and more all these things that you know help you lose weight faster. Uh, but at the end of the day, if you put yourself in a caloric deficit and you're enjoying the foods that you eat um, and they fit within your calories, then you're good to go. Um, with that being said, it is important to still get your macronutrients in. Um, I'm really bad at it, but you know I'm just being honest with you guys. I'm not gonna pretend that I eat all these things when I clearly don't. So I'm just being honest with you guys. This is what I enjoy eating. It's what works for me. It may not work for you. Like you can literally buy the same groceries and you'd be like, bro, this is disgusting. So honestly, you gotta do what works for you. Really thankful for Dario and I'm, you know, look forward to making more content and you know getting the whole picture of 
my life um, on YouTube, I guess. So, I don't know, I just got my head in the game. Kind of, that's what I normally do when I work out. And that's why I don't really film too much. It's because my head gets in the zone. All I want to do is lift weights. And yeah, that's why I barely have any workout footage on the tube. Um, but yeah, I just got home. Um, good a snack away on the poverty grocery haul I made. So I have barbecue crispy minis on the go right now. I got some diet. Or no, it's Pepsi Zero, sorry. Pepsi Zero tastes the same. I think I'm gonna have a Simply Shredder meal. Probably smash one of those. Um, but that's pretty much it for tonight. Alright guys, thanks for watching today's video and I'll see you in the next one.